Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I want to learn you how to crochet this beautiful and simple baby blanket pattern. I used uh, three colors of uh, Guxin brand for this pattern and 3.5 millimeters hook. You can use uh, any yarn and any crochet hook and you can use less or more colors for this pattern and uh, this pattern is uh, very nice for many projects if you're ready let's get started let's start with a slip knot and then chain a multiple of four plus two one two three four and again one two three four and repeat that and when i reach the desired width for my pattern add two chains I made 22 chains totally and now skip first chain from the hook and insert the hook into second chain and make a single crochet and single crochet into next chain single crochet into the next and single crochet into each chain across Okay, at the end of first row, I have 21 stitches, one less than uh, starting chains, chain one and turn the work and for second row, make a single crochet into first stitch here, insert hook into first stitch and make a single crochet. Then skip next stitch and make three double crochet into the next, okay, skip next and one double crochet into the next two and three again skip next stitch and make a single crochet into the next and repeat that skip next stitch and make three double crochet into the next one two and three skip next stitch and single crochet into the next again skip the next three double crochet into the next one two and three skip next and single crochet into the next and repeat that until the end of the row at the end skip next stitch and make a single crochet into last stitch insert the hook into last stitch and yarn over pull up pull up but don't complete that because i want to change the yarn so grab the next yarn i want to use white for this row and pull through these two loops then chain one and pull these two yarns to uh, secure okay for a third row chain three and turn the work in this row i want to make a set of three double crochet here into this space between a uh, single crochet and this group of double crochets here so yarn over insert the hook into this space and yarn over pull up a loop pull through two, pull through two, again, yarn over, insert the hook into same space and make a double crochet and then make last double crochet into same space, okay? I made three double crochet into same space and after that, make a incomplete double crochet into first uh, single crochet of first row here insert the hook into first single crochet of two rows below and yarn over pull up a loop yarn over pull through two but don't complete that yarn over skip these three double crochets and make another incomplete double crochet into next uh, single crochet okay skip one two three single crochets of first row and insert hook into the next single crochet and yarn over pull up a loop yarn over pull through two and now i have three loops on the hook 
yarn over pull through all of them okay after that again make a group of three double crochets here into this space between this single crochet and these uh, three double crochets insert the hook here and make one again two and three then i want to make an incomplete double crochet into same stitch here yarn over insert the hook into same stitch that made a uh, first incomplete double crochet and yarn over pull up a loop yarn over pull through two but don't complete that yarn over skip three single crochet of first row and insert the hook into next single crochet and make incomplete double crochet and now yarn over pull through these three loops on the hook again yarn over and make three double crochet here into this space between this single crochet and these three double crochets here one two and three yarn over insert the hook into same stitch that uh, made a double crochet and yarn over pull up loop yarn over pull through two don't complete that skip these three double crochets and skip one two three single crochet of first row and make a double crochet here into next single crochet and yarn over pull through all loops on the hook and repeat that sequence until the end of the row okay at the end after these three double crochets yarn over insert the hook into same stitch here of first row yarn over pull up a loop yarn over pull through two and don't complete that skip these three double crochets and skip one two three single crochet and insert the hook into last stitch of first row and make another incomplete double crochet then yarn over pull through all loops and now i want to make a group of three double crochet into last stitch of uh, row two yarn over insert the hook into this stitch of previous row and make three double crochet here one two and three but don't complete last stitch i want to change the yarn again so grab the next yarn and pull through these two loops then chain one to secure that and pull these two yarns okay uh, in the first row i have one two three four five group of double crochet but in second row i have one two three four five and six group okay for next row row four chain one and turn the work and make a single crochet into first stitch of previous row here okay then go back to this row two rows below and make a set of double crochets here into second double crochet of this group one and two and three skip first double crochet and insert the hook into second double crochet of the first group of double crochets here and yarn over pull up loop yarn over pull through two and pull through two then go back to this row and make a group of three double crochets here between these two incomplete double crochets insert the hook under these loops and make a group of three double crochets one two and three yarn over insert the hook into same stitch here that's made a double crochet before these three double crochets here and make an incomplete 
double crochet. Okay, yarn over, skip this group and make an incomplete double crochet into second stitch of next group here, one and two. Insert the hook into second and yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two and yarn over, pull through all loops. Then yarn over and make a group of three double crochets here between these two incomplete double crochets. Insert the hook here and make three double crochet, one and two and three. Yarn over, insert the hook into second stitch of uh, two rows below again. And yarn over, pull up loop, yarn over, pull through two, but don't complete that. Yarn over, skip next group of previous row here and insert the hook into second double crochet of uh, two rows below here, one and two. And make another incomplete double crochet. Yarn over, pull through two, yarn over, and make a group of three double crochet here between these two incomplete double crochet of previous row here. One, two, and three. And then repeat that sequence until the end. Okay. At the end, after these three double crochets, yarn over and insert the hook into second double crochet of two rows below and make a double crochet. Make a complete double crochet because I'm at the end of this row and then make a single crochet into third chain of turning chains of previous row here. But don't complete that. I want to change the yarn and grab the first yarn and pull through these two loops. And for next row, I want to repeat this row, row three. One, two, three chains and turn the work and make a group of double crochets here between first single crochet and this group. One, two, and three. Then go back to two rows below here and insert the hook into second double crochet of first group and make an incomplete double crochet. Then skip this group of previous row and go back to two rows below and insert the hook into second double crochet of next group and make an incomplete double crochet here, then yarn over, pull through two loops and make a group of three double crochet here into this space between these two incomplete double crochet of previous row here. One, two, and three. And repeat that. Yarn over, insert the hook into same double crochet of two rows below. One, skip this group and make another incomplete double crochet into second stitch of next group. And yarn over, pull through all loops and make another group of three double crochets here into this space between these two incomplete double crochet of uh, previous row. And repeat that until the end of the row. At the end, I made uh, one incomplete double crochet here and then make an incomplete double crochet into second double crochet of uh, last group of two rows below here. And yarn over, pull through all loops, then make three double crochet into last stitch, last single crochet of previous row. One, two, and three, and change the yarn for next row. And after that, I have to repeat row four and then row five. 
these two rows, row 4 and row 5, must be uh, repeated several times until you reach the desired height for your pattern. I repeat these two rows. I repeated those two rows several times and this is my pattern. You can see that the front view and back view are the same in this pattern and you must uh, change the yarn at the end of each row and uh, use another yarn for um, next row. I hope this video will be useful for you. If you like that, please uh, thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Have a nice day.